Hello B Nation and welcome back. In today's video, we're going to be unboxing a replica of the Benelli Mini Cross, which is a 118 scale die cast motorcycle replica manufactured by Leo Models, which is a Chinese manufacturer. And I'm going to be showing you the features and the specifications of this amazing die cast motorcycle replica. So stay tuned with me on this one and let's get this started. So, before we get to the good stuff, let's take a quick look at the boxing as always. This Benelli Mini Cross replica comes mounted on a base plate with the model name on it and in a standard clamshell type box which is the standard boxing by Leo Models. So let's go ahead and take a closer look at the packaging and get this thing open. So, to begin with, my first thoughts about this 118 scale Benelli Mini Cross diecast replica is that it has quite a good and sturdy build quality and made of diecast for the most part with a few components made of ABS plastic. And I should admit that this model is amazingly detailed to the T and looks quite stunning and is definitely a miniature version of its real life counterpart which brings us to the price which I should admit that this replica by Leo Models is way more heavy on the pockets compared to the regular 118 scale diecast motorcycle brands. So getting down to a few features and specifications, this replica measures in at 8 cm in length, 6 cm in height, 4 cm in width and weighs in approximately at about 100 grams which are not the standard 118 scale diecast motorcycle specs which we will discuss in a bit so stay tuned. And with that out of the way, let's go ahead and take a closer look at the features and the functionality of this 118 scale Benelli Mini Cross diecast replica and please do let me know as to what are your favorite features regarding this awesome diecast replica in the comments below. So let's go ahead and take a closer look. Well, I should once again admit that this diecast replica is amazingly detailed considering its size and I'm mind blown after getting a hands on. However, as I mentioned earlier, this replica does not fall into the usual 118 scale diecast motorcycle specs and is actually quite smaller in size compared to the standard 118 scale diecast motorcycles. But I guess this is because in real life the Benelli Mini Cross is actually a mini bike and Leo models scale it down accordingly to its real life proportions. But that's my opinion, so please go ahead and let me know in the comments below as to what are your thoughts regarding this scale model. And with that out of the way, let's go ahead and make a side-by-side -side comparison of this Benelli Mini Cross alongside the Honda Gorilla, which is also a 118 scale diecast mini bike replica by Welly, and also alongside a 118 scale diecast Vespa scooter by Maisto. And this is just to give you an idea about the scale and size differences. So let's go ahead and take a look.
By the looks of it, it's sure obvious that there is quite a difference in size. But irrespective of that factor, all I can say is that this is a beautiful and amazingly detailed diecast replica of the Benelli Mini Cross and I'm glad that I got this model to add to my 118 scale diecast motorcycle collection. So overall this is a beautiful diecast replica and a definite must have for any diecast motorcycle collector or hobbyist especially if you are a mini bike enthusiast. And in case you're interested, kindly find further features, specifications and the best buy link for this diecast replica in the description below. So with that out of the way, let's place this amazing and well detailed Benelli Mini Cross replica on the D-Nation Dino and check out its wheel spin and its functionality. Well, the functionality seems to be perfect and just as beautiful as the highly detailed exteriors and this amazing mini motorcycle replica gets a massive thumbs up from me for its looks as well as for its functionality. So with that being said, let's place this amazing diecast replica on the D-Nation turntable and take a look at this diecast beauty in a 360 degree view and stay tuned for some fun facts on Benelli coming up. Benelli QJ is an Italian company based in the city of Pesaro in the Marche region that produces motorcycles and scooters. Since 2005, Benelli is owned by the Qijiang Motorcycles, which is a Chinese company owned by Geely Holding Group. Originally founded in 1911 in Pesaro, Benelli is the second oldest Italian motorcycle company still in business. Design, development and marketing activities are carried out in Benelli QJ headquarters in Pesaro, Italy in synergy with the parent company of Wendling, China, where motorcycles are produced. In the beginning, it was just a Benelli garage which repaired bicycles and motorcycles but was already able to produce all of the spare parts needed for repairs. During World War I, Benelli worked hard fixing parts for the Italian machines in war and in 1919, the first motorcycle was presented to the public. In 1920, the company built its first complete engine in-house which is a single-cylinder two-stroke 75cc model, immediately adapted to the bicycle frame. A year later, in 1921, Benelli built its first motorcycle using their own engine, which had by then become a 98cc model. And for further information on Benelli, kindly check the link in the description below. And if you want to get yourself or your loved ones this amazing Benelli Mini Cross replica, I dropped the Best Buy link in the description below. So go check it out and get yourself one if you're interested. And also please do let me know in the comments below as to what are your thoughts about this amazing Benelli diecast motorcycle replica. And kindly continue to support D-Nation by liking and sharing our videos as it would really help us out a lot. And in case you missed out on our previous episodes, please do check out the rest of the 118 scale and the 112 scale diecast motorcycle episodes and a lot more fun stuff in the playlist below. And this brings us to the end of this episode and I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed making it for you. And if you guys enjoyed this video, a like, comment and share would be much appreciated. And kindly support D-Nation by subscribing to our channel if you haven't already and click that notification bell icon so you don't miss out on any of our upcoming episodes. Also do follow us at dnation.in on Instagram for daily diecast previews and updates and stay tuned for all new and one-of-a-kind episodes coming up. Well, thank you for watching, take care, and I'll see you on the next one.